Guys, it's been two months. I have made a video, but let me tell y'all the truth. On some real shit, we need to talk. I've been depressed. Oh. You know? I think the key part of that is I don't have a, I don't have a girlfriend. You know, it's just like sexy, chocolate, dark skinned nigga like me. I can't keep a bitch. But uh, that's gonna change today, cause today we 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 went to the professionals. You guys said, did you go to therapy? Fuck no. I'm a man. You know what I did instead? I hired an online dating coach. So in today's video, we're gonna take their advice and we're gonna somehow find a girlfriend. Yeah, you know, Isaiah, like, Isaiah, why are you wearing this shirt? I have no fucking idea. I just really thought it was gonna be funny. I really don't know. This is like the sassiest shit I own. My you like my little like niece or something, but for the video, I think this shit would be fucking hilarious. And it's probably not gonna make the video. Anyways, I think that's a good intro. Guys, I think I ran in to get a girlfriend. All right, I'm ready for our meeting. Okay, uh, so um, my name is Margueta. So what is your name? My name is Carlton. And I'm really having trouble finding a girlfriend. And I don't know uh -huh. what I'm doing wrong. Okay, could you tell me how old are you? Where do you live? I'm, not, I'm 19 years of age. You're just 19 years old, right? Yeah, I, uh, I, li I live in uh, Arkansas. There's a, little, there's a lot of pretty white women here. And I would, would just love to, like, <clears throat> just, just, just see them one day. But I don't think they like my type of people. What do you mean by saying my type of people? I mean... I'm the only black kid in my own school, so it's pretty hard. Uh -huh. It's pretty hard for me to get a pretty girl to like me. And do you feel like uh, you like a special case in your surroundings? Yeah, I think, I, think I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm the Malcolm X of this school, so that's, that's pretty, that's going pretty good. Uh, very interesting what you just said, that you are looking for a pretty white girl. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's my type. Our, it's, it's what you like, right? Taylor Swift, you know, all those Olivia Rodrigo and uh, don't let me get started on on Adele, you know. I have, I have fantasies about her. Mm -hmm. What is your experience with uh, dating in general? Okay, okay. So, <laughs> one time when I was 14, I always keep this with me, but uh, <laughs> I, got, I, got, I got this girl's... <laughs> Bra, you know, we were, well, she didn't know I was there, but, you know, it was, it was, it, I mean, it's fine, I mean, I mean, she, like, I told her about it, but, I mean, experience dating, I mean, I, I feel like I dated some girls, I don't know, if they considered them to be in a relationship with me, though. Mm -hmm. But you have some experience. I mean, I, 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 can I tell you the truth? Okay, sure. I haven't even kissed the girl yet. Mm -hmm. And why do you think that there's something wrong about it? There because are so many different people. My, my friend Jake, my friend Jake, oh my gosh. He is fucking every night. Oh my gosh. Jenna, Ella, oh my, it's all, all, all the pretty girls. And he just, he just won't save any for me. It's just, it's so hard being friends with Jake because he he's kind of cute. It's like he kind of looks like if 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 like Gordon Hayward and Joe Biden had a son, that would be Jake, and that's a pretty attractive guy. Okay, so now I see that you're comparing yourself with your friend, or maybe also comparing yourself with everybody else. Mm -hmm. But you need to start comparing yourself with yourself. Like, could you tell me some positive things about you? I mean, with this ruler. I measure myself every once in a while. I'm almost at three. I, I, I've been really excited for that. That's probably my biggest accomplishment. Mm -hmm. But you know, like uh, people, you know, when they meet another person, they're looking into personality, you know, the way you act, the way you behave. Do you think of there's something wrong with the way I act? No, I'm just saying that it's very um, normal to invest in let's say, improving yourself in general. 
Like, that's why I'm trying to get to you. three inches. Uh, sorry? I'm trying that's why I'm trying to get to three inches. I do I do the raises every day. I don't know if you know what the raises are. Mm, I'm not sure about it. So when you go up and down to build stamina and strength in your pelvic re region. Mm -hmm. So you're working on, on your RPMs, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, that's okay. What about like the way you look at the situation? Like, I see that you have a lot of uh, anxiety. You know? Why do you think that? <coughs> because I feel like you are stressed about the situation. Because I want I just want to know what the touchable woman feels like. <sighs> okay. Could you tell me how do you relax when you go out and meet people? Excuse me, what you say? Okay. So when I mention you that it's very important, you know, a, a personality, you know. It's very important, you know, how how you approach a uh, woman. Oh, you want? Oh, you want to? You want to see my W wrist? Uh, what is that? My, the, the the way I talk to women, my my W wrist. Okay, the, just you could just describe me, you know, how you approach women okay. in general. Okay, right. I'll I'll, I'll, I'll 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 start over, or I'll I'll pretend like we're in a coffee shop. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call you Becky. Is that okay? Yeah. Hey Becky, your boobs are huge. Mm -hmm. So you're targeting the appearance immediately, right? Mm -hmm. Doesn't I, don't all girls like compliments? You can scare the woman off. You know. I don't want to scare woman away. I don't want to scare them. Look, um, I, want, I, I really want to help you. How you. Can you give me a good pickup line then? So I can use. Mm -hmm. Okay. I would not recommend you a pickup line because it usually doesn't work. I would suggest you to find activities where you enjoy what you enjoy doing in general, like. Could you tell me activities you enjoy doing? Masturbating. Um, I'm talking about more like social activities. I mean, a library is social. Uh, Libraries? What else? I, I I like to I like to I like to game. I'm a, I'm kind of I'm kind of, I'm kind of a gamer. Gamer. Okay, so this is also kind of like social activity. Do you communicate with people there? No, I got bullied. Mm -hmm. Who is bullying you? Who is bullying you? In school, I used to eat bananas a lot. And they used to call me Monkey Boy 445. This is really disgusting behavior from those kind of people. It was Jake, but I think, you know, Jake's my best friend. I think he was just joking. Mm -hmm. You know, nobody deserved to be called like this. You know, those people... They didn't know how to, to treat another human be being right, right? So, how, how do you feel now? Like, how do you feel in general? I think a girl would just really, a girlfriend would really just help help me because I would have somebody to talk to and, and, and that likes me and, and stuff. And that's all I want is some love. I just want some loving. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so the only, let's say, approach you tried, it was just, you was just approaching girls in the public places and you, you was complimenting them, right? Oh yeah, at the mall, like, I'll run behind them and kind of chase them, and well, sometimes they'll run, so I think we're playing tag, and then I'll be like, hey guys, like, I thought your butt was pretty big, uh, and my credit score is a 770, so do you guys, like, want to go on a date? And a lot of times they would just walk away and ignore me. Like I'm not a person. Okay, so uh, do you know why it is the case? My credit score is not high think? enough? It's about how you compliment. Because uh, complimenting the 
body parts. It's it's not the way to go. Trust me. It's it really scares people away. So I'll be scaring the hoes. I'm saying that it's possible to change the behavior. I'm, I'm am I scaring it. the hoes? Uh, maybe somebody will like it. I don't know. I really don't know. But it's very rare that somebody will like it, right? Mm -hmm. So what I'm suggesting you is to change how you approach women. Okay. Don't don't ever approach a woman by commenting on her body parts. All right. You want, do you want to try again? Oh, 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 mm -hmm. oh, okay. One second. Hey, Becky. How's your day going? I really like your glasses and your shirt, and your pants make your butt look big. Okay, that was quite of nice. It, it, it's much nicer, you oh, know? Thank you. You started, you started from, like, how, how your day is going, and maybe you don't have to tell you anymore. You ask the question and let the conversation flow. Mm -hmm. Like I, for example, if you approach a girl in library, you can say, "I see that you are reading this kind of book and so on." Like you can talk about the books, about the books you read, right? I don't read. I just game. That's why I didn't get into college. Mm -hmm. So, what is the reason why you're going to library? Oh, just to talk to girls. You know, everything I do is for the bitches. I go to the gym. Just to get pretty athletic women. I go to the library to get the smart uh, book girls. I go to the grocery stores to get the girls who know how to cook. Everything I do about my day is catered towards the hoes. Mm -hmm. Okay. What about just a woman? A woman who is not the prettiest, not the smartest. Maybe just a woman. So somebody. So you want me to talk to somebody mid? No, like... Uh... Let's say average. Like, so, why do you think that the, why do you think that the woman in the gym, that the best looking person in the gym, is the best person for you? Because it's also character, you know, her values, many things. It's not just the way she looks mm -hmm. or if she's able to cook, right? I think that you need any kind of connection. Mm -hmm. Maybe not necessarily targeting, um, let's say, you don't have to target a woman, you know. You don't you have to gay? make her a girlfriend. Uh, I'm not no, gay. It's what I'm, no, no, I didn't say that. No Jane Charles. I said no that, Jane Charles. No. Uh, what I said, I said that you don't have to make a, a girl your girlfriend. You need to, in general. Just be for, friends for with a girl? No, well, it's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that for the beginning, it's okay to have any kind of connection oh. and see where conversation is going to lead. The best way to meet people is in the familiar social settings. For example, if you are a gamer, maybe there's like a girl who's also into gaming, right? Oh my gosh, that would be so cool. Uh-huh. I know actually those kind of cases. People get together, right? You know any girls that game? I, I don't, but I, I know the stories. I mean, I knew before, but I know the really, really amazing stories. People get together. I, so could, pretend to do, I could pretend to do sports. I have a bass. Or, you know, you know can, what, can I talk what about the, under, can I do the undercover, undercover method? What is that? The undercover method. Well, I could join the cheer team. And pretend to be gay and then get invited to the sleepovers with all the girls and then when they're changing and stuff i can like kind of talk to them because i'm already there okay uh, i would definitely not recommend that because it's kind of like cheating right well i lie i cheat i still i feel like little eddie i lie cheating still bitch i feel like little eddie that's a baby okay. job on. it's fine I would not recommend to cheat anybody, right? Because you want to be honest for yourself or for, and for others. You know, you want to be a good a human being, right? And debatable. Well, I do understand, but the thing is, like, you're like, um, you you want a girlfriend so much that you, you could do everything. And what I'm suggesting is.
yeah, what I'm suggesting to back off a little bit and more concentrate in yourself. Okay. Be more relaxed. You know, for example, instead of saying, I need to find a girlfriend, you can say, I will try to find some connection, some relationship, maybe friendship, maybe girlfriend. You don't know that yet. I have a 770 credit score, so I can afford to spend. Well, I bought Bella Delphine's bath water for like four thousand dollars. So I have a, I have a, I have a pretty, I got, have a, I have a pretty hefty amount of money if I do need to be desperate. Then you really want maybe not a girlfriend. Then. I just want to feel the touch of a woman. I haven't been in pussy since the day I came out. One. <laughs> Would you say that you don't have any experience with women? Like no experience, no kissing, no hugging. Well, one time in third grade, uh, Taylor Radford, she was like the prettiest girl in the whole school. Uh, one time she called me a dweeb in front of everybody, but when she said it, she kind of looked me in my eyes. So I think she might have a crush on me. Okay. And later, like uh, in the recent years? Oh, that was third grade. Uh, I mean, one time this girl stuffed me in my locker. That felt pretty nice because a girl's never put her hands on me before. Mm -hmm. So you don't have like, let's say, um, honest relationship and it would be lasting, let's say, a relationship, right? No. Traveling, doing sport and so on. The girls Your in focus... Thailand I heard are really easy to get. You can just pay for them. Mm -hmm. So I think mm -hmm. I might travel. I might do that. Thank you so much for this meeting. I think that's what we came across, that I just need to travel and go to a thorough old country and pay them. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Well, it's not what I was saying, but I'm just saying that you can concentrate more focus on your personality than yourself instead of focusing on relationship itself, right? Thank you. Okay. Okay. Take care, bye. Reminiscing about a time when you wasn't by my side, everything was going fast.